what is happening people so today is our first day out doing some rabbit hunting and uh, today we have two packs of dogs that's Kenny right there you see I, how many dogs you got seven six. you got six on the ground I got five so we got 11 dogs so this is the first time that we've hunted together let our dogs jail and uh, first of the season so they're not tough we got a few young dogs so on our first outing we'll be paying attention to those dogs in case they get off on some trash trash is a deer a coyote or whatever and uh, so we're gonna hunt in this old trash pile right here see if we can jump one and we'll make our way around the farm it's not a lot of thickets in this farm and uh, we're not really worried about shooting a rabbit more or less letting the dogs run together, making sure they pack well, dog don't pull out. So come on along with us and uh, we'll go see if we can jump us a rabbit. So you notice there is a road behind us and we're hunting down through this stuff here. So we're gonna, uh, we're gonna keep an eye out and uh, if they jump a rabbit and they head towards the road, we're gonna try to shoot the rabbit. But as long as they go on down past this pond you see in the background, we'll let the rabbit go and let the dogs run. So always be mindful if you got a road close, we don't wanna get any dogs killed in the road. That is a jump. Unfortunately, going right to the neighbor's house. <laughs> Maybe they get it across one of these openings and we can keep it down in the bottom. That'll 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 shake them out of the bed. <laughs> Yeah, maybe she'll turn the rabbit for us. They probably run them all under the house. Oh yeah, they trail. Yeah, they trailed the rabbit the whole time. This bottom, I don't know if you can see those old cabins. The rabbit's over there on that side. Maybe we'll get to see him when he comes back this way. So 
So the rabbit has thrown a full loop <clears throat> on the side of that hill over there next to this barn. I see Maggie and Trixie making a big loop around trying to pick the rabbit trail up. So normally, after they make a good loop all the way around, the dogs do. It's a good indication that the rabbit is still over there uh, sitting down on them. I think the rabbit's still over there on that hill. What do you think? They went all the way over there to that far cabin. They went to the cabin. Don't know. I'll give you a little update. So the first rabbit we jumped, finally we figured out he went up under an old cabin over there. We couldn't get him out from under it. So they did some cold trailing. We've hunted down this bottom behind us. Uh, haven't really had a lot of uh, cover for the rabbits to be under. So we're in this creek bottom now and uh, got a lot of briars and honeysuckles and thick stuff behind us. So hopefully we'll get another one up here in just a few minutes. <laughs> Bring the chainsaw down here. like we got to jump. He's a foot. And all this thick stuff right here. The dog's have to make his way out. He'll probably go up that bottom. I don't know how thick as that is. He might turn and come right back in here. Got to get his dip out. <laughs> then jump the rabbit time and put a dip in. Uh -huh. Soak it in while you can. I'm rolling. I hear Buddy like right that. I hear he got a deep voice going. We ran him in a hole. And when they got down there and then they quit. <clears throat> and that's exactly, <clears throat> they went right up that little draw coming up this way. Hey, what's happening, guys? So we're going to end this video. 
So we got back, we only jumped two rabbits, run one under that old house place, and then ran one in a hole down there in the bottom. And, uh, but we won't aim to shoot the rabbits anyway. Day is a good training day. And uh, you'll notice we just loaded the dogs up. Having a good pack of dogs is, uh, they have to be trained to load and unload out of the truck. Makes things a lot easier on the hunter. Hey guys, we enjoyed the day. I hope you enjoyed the video. And remember, it's a wildlife, and I'll see you in the field.